In this short video, I want to explain to you one of the challenges that I have when I'm selling replacement dejectronic fuel injectors for those V8s between 1970 and 1975 in the U.S. market. These are the 3.5, 4.5 V8s with electronic fuel injection. That means they have a fuel injector that's triggered electronically. You can see the contact points there. Here's the deal. Somewhere in 1974, they changed the seals and the way the injector sealed into the head. They did not change the injector. This injector is the same for all DJetronic V8s, Mercedes Benz. The top seal, which is the hold down seal that goes right here, is the same on all engines. What they did change is right down here at the tip. And I think they probably changed it because they were having heat problems with the original seals and they were leaking air and that causes the engine to do all kinds of strange things. So on the early models, starting in 1970 up through sometime in early 74, this is the seal. That's all that was put on the injector other than that top one. And then it was installed in the head just like in my 300 SEL 4.5. That was it. So when you order my injectors, you're only going to get the seal. And if you have one of those 4 to 75, and don't ask me, how do you tell? By just looking at the engine, you have to remove a fuel injector. When you remove a fuel injector, you'll see a nylon sleeve. And that will give you an indication you're going to need these seals right here, which do not come with my replacement fuel injectors. The sleeves are NLA, no longer available, so you need to try to save those original nylon sleeves. But I am able to offer these seals as of April 2024. I don't know how much longer these seals are going to be available either. So in those models that have the sleeve, once again, you pull an injector out. If you see a nylon sleeve, you're going to need these seals. If there's no nylon sleeve, this is all you're going to have, and that's what comes with my set of injectors. Okay, so in those models with the sleeve, you need two seals per injector. This green one would go on right here like this, and then this black one would go on the bottom like that. So I think you can see what was going on here. You don't even need to be an engineer. Mercedes decided we got to do something better to keep these injectors sealed from air leaks. So if you have a 74 to 75, you have to be careful here because engines get changed. You got to pull an injector and determine if you're going to need these newer seals. Now I do provide these, but they're sold separately. So they are not included with injectors. You basically get these seals with my set of new injectors. And then if you have one of these later models with the sleeve, I offer those seals separately. And you're going to end up with one little seal here. No, I can't give you a refund on that because that's not worth very much money. You'll just have a little extra seal there that you'll have to throw away. But the larger rings here that come in my kit are usable on all models from 1970 to 1975.